Yo, what's up guys? My name is Jay and welcome back to another video. Uh, today we have a kind of a special video here on YouTube. Um, I'm going to make a little bit of an update video on our shiny living decks that we have been doing recent, or well, recently for the past year or so. Um, on our Twitch channel and by extension the reactions are on YouTube here. Um, I have 11 at the moment and some of you guys here on YouTube might notice that there are less videos and uh, that's because of uh, a few uh, Pokemon that aren't really all that exciting for a video and uh, yeah, basically have some technical issues I missed some footage here and there and when I had that I was like okay let's just make one update video with the ones that aren't interesting because they are only transferred in or so and uh, yeah here we are in the video so uh, if I go and look here we have Genesect, it's one. I caught it in Pokemon Go during a special event week. Sadly, it isn't available anymore. But yeah, eventually they will all come back, so you guys have a chance to get that. And with the new Pokemon uh, Go integration that has been out for about a month now, I guess, uh, you guys can just transfer it in into Pokemon Home and then into Pokemon Sword and Shield. Um, yeah, Zero Aura here has been an event when the Isle of Armor first released. And yeah, then at that point, sadly, this one isn't available anymore. Um, you had like a week after the event stopped and we reached the goal of like 1 million rates or so defeated. Uh, you could, everyone could get a shiny Zero Aura. And yeah, also we have Melten here and Melmetal. And those guys um, were caught, of course, in uh, Pokemon Go since that's the only um, legal way to get them. And yeah, the shinies were during the special uh, events because uh, contrary to all other months in Pokemon Go, uh, they are basically all available normally and Melton and Melmetal are only in special weeks or events. So yeah, and uh, I transferred these in in Pokemon uh, Let's Go Eevee. And as I said earlier, these uh, that video file sadly has been corrupted so I couldn't use it. But yeah, I was like, you know what, let's go and show them off here for a second in uh, the beautiful freezing crown tundra. Here we have our little friend Melton. How are you doing, little buddy? Ah, oh, he's so happy. Alright, let's go and run into a building. Okay, Melton, you're a little bit slow, so I'm just going to run ahead. Watch me get the shiny Beldum out of this. Ah, oh, luckily not. <laughs> But yeah, there he is, a uh, beautiful, shiny, small Melton. And as you guys can see, Melton's level 12. I didn't use him at all, basically. Uh, I did get some uh, natures on these guys, like Melton and Melmetal. These guys have, I believe they have a jolly nature. Because of, uh, of course, the attack is the best uh, stat for Melmetal. Uh, oh, I got adamant. Oh wait, of course, yeah. Look at that speed, it's 6. Why would I even want to run Jolly? It would be still like one of the slowest ones out there. But yeah, that's why the levels are a little bit weird, like doing level 12 for shiny mid goals. That's kind of strange. So yeah. But I do really like these ones, like Melton and Melmetal. I still think of them like that random Pokemon uh, in Pokemon Go and never really think of it as something really for the mainline uh, of Pokemon games, but yeah, look at how big he is too. But uh, yeah, I still think of them like that random Pokemon that just appeared after, I believe, Chikorita's Community Day in Pokemon Go. And yeah, here we go, now he's in the game, oh yo 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 yo. No 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 Sneasel, let me quickly show off our next beautiful member. It's a beautiful Genesect that I got in Pokemon Go and transferred in. Look at him. And I love this, like... Some of you guys might notice that Lycanroc, that is the reason shiny at the moment. In that same stream that I got uh, Rockruff before I evolved it. Um, I had a sprite for uh, Genesec because I just transferred it in. And yeah, it looks so washed out, like... Really washed out color of red. And here in Sword and Shield in, on the Switch, it looks so much better. Like, <laughs> night and day comparison. So yeah, here we go. We have a beautiful shiny Genesect. Of course, sadly, you can't get them at the moment, but there's always a, 
a time and a place for it later in Pokemon Go. I just hope that one day we can just hunt every mythical um, actually in the main games themselves and not really specifically in Pokemon Go. So. And here we have our last uh, show off. Zerubar is actually pretty large. Damn, I didn't even notice that. And he's fast too, Jesus. Can he keep up with me? We go around. Yeah, he can't really keep up, okay. But yeah, let's uh, show this beautiful shiny off. It's level 100, so... <laughs> and I really do like the shiny. Like, the mon itself is like, eh. Because, of course, uh, basically since Gen 4, or no, last Gen was Gen 5, without, uh, or with the special events, like, actually in-game. Uh, I believe Galdia was the last one that actually had an event in-game that had a little bit of story behind it. But uh, yeah, I, since that moment I don't really care all that much about medicals. I never really did to begin with. But now that they don't even have a story or an event, it's just you know, download these code. Yeah, it's not really my cup of tea, but... Hey, if it's yours, it's uh, fun to get them just easily, right? I just wish they will uh, go and put them back like something with a story behind it, like for example, uh, the little red triangle, like the puzzle for uh, the axis, something like that was cool back in the day. So, yeah, and uh, of course we could shiny hunt them back in the day too. I hope it's hopefully virtual console, but, uh, Ruby, Sapphire, Emerald, that we could hunt uh, something like the Mew again in Emerald. But of course it's uh, just a hope of mine, and first of all we don't even know if uh, virtual constant Hoenn is uh, coming out, but yeah, I've uh, been talking of, uh, long enough now <laughs> and uh, yeah, these guys are basically the ones that we didn't show yet uh, so far here on YouTube and uh, yeah, here we go. Now you guys saw them, I can uh, just go on with the shiny decks. Hopefully everything should be fine and I don't get a corrupted file so I can just uh, upload the normal reactions too, even though these guys really didn't have a reaction because I didn't get them live in Pokemon Go on stream, but offline in Pokemon Go. Yeah, Zero Aura was like, okay, cool, I've got it now, so, yeah. And uh, yeah, at the last minute here of uh, of this video, I really want to thank you guys so much for the recent support. Like, I saw that my uh, Darkrai video is doing pretty well on average for my, uh, yeah, for my YouTube channel. On Twitch side, uh, since of course primarily I stream on Twitch and then the, the videos are, uh, Basically highlights, like shiny reactions from the streams itself. If you really want to go and uh, be here with me live on Twitch, the link is in the description. You guys can, uh, yeah, join me over here and uh, yeah, just have some beautiful moments together and maybe uh, catch a shiny live. But yeah, as I was saying, I got like 1k views now on, uh, on Twitch. We're very close to the 100 followers mark. Like, yeah, it's insane to think about and just a random guy in a bedroom and uh, or bedroom yeah <laughs> where i sleep and uh, yeah i uh it just boggles my mind to think about that you guys uh, watch my videos watch my twitch and uh just watch me scream at a random sprite that has a little bit of different color so yeah i want to thank you all so much for the support it really means a lot and uh yeah if you haven't already please drop a like uh subscribe hit that bell you never miss the upload and uh yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. So, have a great rest of your day. My name is Jay, and I'm out. Peace.